During a ceremony on Sunday morning, the Iranian air defense units took delivery of homegrown Kara drones, equipped with a sophisticated air-to-air -air missile that allows for the interception of hostile aerial targets. The ceremony was held in the presence of the commander of the Iran Army Air Defense Force Brigadier General Alariza Sabahi Fard. The commander of the Iranian Army, Major General Abdolrahim Massavi, also attended the ceremony. The Kara drone paired with Majid missile would allow the air defense units along the border areas to intercept and destroy hostile aerial targets at a much lower cost than the sorties made by Manjet fighters. The homegrown Majid air defense missile can track and intercept targets with thermal and optical seekers. The new missile armed drones will enable the air defense units to carry out air based tactical defense operations in various geographical locations at a lower cost than the employment of manned warplanes and with much lower risks. In September, Deputy Commander of the Iranian Army's Air Defense Force Brigadier General Alariz Alhami said Karar has been equipped with a radar. The general said Karar has several times forced the foreign manned and unmanned aircraft to change their course over the Persian Gulf and Sea of Oman at high altitudes. Karar is the first Iranian military drone that has set a service ceiling record by reaching an altitude of 47,000 feet, he noted. Adding that the drone has given radar or radio warnings to the foreign aircraft that have been approaching Iran's coastal waters or its flight information region, FIR. Known as an advanced interceptor drone, Karar is among the new generation of Iran's jet drones, configured to intercept the enemy's flying objects. It enables the country's armed forces to conduct a broader range of air defense operations at high altitudes. Attending the army event, the commander-in-chief of the Islamic Republic of Iran Army stressed that the event was another stage of upgrading the capabilities of the Islamic Republic of Iran Air Defense Force. Addressing Iran's enemies, he said that the enemies should reconsider their air-to-air -air combat strategies and tactics, especially in the drone field, because Iran has a special status in this field today. Also, the commander of Iran's Army Air Defense said that with scientific and round-the-clock joint work between the Air Defense Forces and the Ministry of Defense, for the first time, Iranians succeeded in building and producing armed drones and Majid missiles. Dozens of homegrown Kara drones, equipped with air-to-air -air Majid missiles, have joined Iran Army's Air Defense Force. The unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, was unveiled during a ceremony at Katam Al Anbiya Air Defense Academy in Tehran on Sunday, in the presence of a group of military commanders and officials. The Kara drones armed with Majid missiles are capable of intercepting and engaging any flying objects and hostile targets. They successfully performed operations during a large-scale drone drill by the Islamic Republic of Iran Army in October. Iran Army takes steps to strengthen air defense force. Speaking at the event, Chief Commander of the Iranian Army Major General Abdolrahim Massavi said that the development demonstrated another stage in the process of upgrading the power of the Islamic Republic of Iran Air Defense Force. Today, the Iranian army meets its own needs through the cooperation of its scientists with the Ministry of Industry, Mine and Trade, and Knowledge-Based Corps. This is because strengthening the defense power across land, sea and air borders is an inseparable principle of the army he added.
Misavi also advised the enemies to reconsider their air-to-air -air combat strategies, especially in the field of UAVs, noting that Iran Army's air defense force has the upper hand in aerial combats. Enemies oppose Iran's power experience has proven that our power drives the enemy to despair," he said. Last month, commander of the Iranian Army's Air Defense Force Brigadier General Alariza Sabahifard said on Sunday that his forces have managed to furnish Kara drone with a heat-seeking air-to-air missile with a range of 8 kilometers. After a year and a half of research and trial, the air defense experts made a series of technical modifications to Majid's surface-to-air missile and turned it into an air-based missile, he said. He said the Kara drone has been armed with Majid missile, whose warhead can detonate various aerial targets. Karar is the first Iranian military drone that has set a service ceiling record by reaching an altitude of 47,000 feet. The drone has in the past given radar and radio warnings to foreign aircraft that have been approaching Iran's coastal waters or its flight information region, FIR.